A Nobel Peace Prize winner Nargis Mohammadi, currently jailed in Iran for her activism for women's rights, began a new hunger strike in prison on the day her prize is awarded in Norway. This strike is a show of solidarity towards the Baha'i's religious minority in Iran. And in a short while from now, Mohammadi's twin, 17-year-old children who live in exile in Paris will accept the award at Oslo City Hall and give the Nobel Peace Prize lecture on her behalf. Both the children fear that they might never meet their mother again, but are proud of her mother's struggle. Mohammadi won the Nobel Peace Prize on October 6th. So to begin with, quite simply, we must always keep hope and continue to fight for this fight, because yes, it is worth it. And then, concerning the following generations, this is exactly what my mother is fighting for. It's so that tomorrow, in Iran, I have as many rights as my brother. Elle se bat particulièrement pour les femmes. Mohamedi, currently being held in Tehran's notorious prison, also went on another hunger strike last month to protest against the obligation for women to wear the hijab in Iran. In a letter smuggled out from the prison and published, Mohamedi said, and I quote her here, imprisonment, psychological torture, constant solitary confinement, sentence after sentence, that hasn't and is not going to stop me. Mohamedi's Nobel Prize came in the wake of months-long protests across Iran triggered by the September 2022 death in custody of Mahsa Amini, who was arrested for allegedly breaking Iran's strict dress rules for women. The Norwegian Nobel Committee says that the award recognizes thousands who demonstrated against the crackdown on women's rights in Iran. Mohamedi is the 19th woman to win the prize and the fifth person to win it while in detention.